What Some are, are saying that of? you're bipolar. Wow, what does that mean? I guess that, you know, you're on two ends of the spectrum. Wow. And then what? What's the cure? Medicine? Make me like them? Not gonna happen. I'm by winning. And I was banging seven gram rocks. That's how I roll. That's how I roll. I'm just winning. I blinked and I cured my brain. I have one speed, one gear. Go. Oh, shut up. Shut up. Stop. And so, you know, uh, uh, um, move forward. I use a blender, I use a vacuum cleaner, I use, uh, stop. You know, I, you know, household items. I'm by winning. And I was banging seven gram rocks. That's how I roll. That's how I roll. I'm just winning. I blinked and I cured my brain. I have one speed, one gear. Go. Yeah, I, I, I am on a drug. It's called Charlotte Sheen. Stop. It, uh, it's not available because if you and then what? Because if you try it once, you will die. Your face will melt off. You ruby-eyed, armless children. Wow, what does that mean? <laughs> I'm by winning. And I was banging seven gram rocks. That's how I roll. That's how I roll. I'm just winning. I blinked and I cured my brain. I have one speed, one gear. Go. You know, I get tired of blood. Justin. Hello? Justin, what's up? Everything's going doing? good. Um, yeah. Um, How's the weather? Uh, well, it was a little um, cold this morning, but uh, it was kind of started to rain when I it was kind of like a cloudy um a little sunny cloudy mixture um then it started to rain when I came a little bit when I came back not too much though didn't grizzle it's just like a little bit of rain before I went away walking home um but everything uh my work day went well um I made money that's all that matters um still looking for a dog Oh yes, um, I'm. I'm still gonna do that. I'm still getting a dog. Yeah. Without Are you plans for that? Are you yeah, planning that? Um, money. I'm gonna adopt a dog. Um, Chesapeake Animal Shelter. Okay. Um, I'm right, awesome. trying to contact Sherry since she's been out of the hospital. And I, I basically got my all my thoughts and prayers. But the Sherry's, uh, she says, recovered now. Which is, uh, God bless her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know if we should be talking about Sherry, uh, Sherry's uh, issues or anything like that. Maybe we should. Oh, no. we should be with that. So anyway, um, what's sorry. going on? You start. You started this. Um, you started this new community. You're trying to get uh, people involved with this thing called the AAC. Um, you left uh, another community. What, what's going on? Oh yes, I left that community. Um, uh, Tac Fam just turned out to be a kind of a cult, and like anyone is trying to tell you what to do, and they, like basically tell you what kind of content you could put on your channel. And I was like, I was done with this shit. You know I mean, it's basically like a, they were trying to run it like a military organization. I was like, this is getting crazy, and it's like this guy was acting like he was a wannabe cult member, a like, wannabe cult leader. You know I mean. All right, so yeah. you, you didn't you didn't you didn't agree with it anymore. You guys got out. You guys are on good terms. Um, you know, somewhat. Whatever. All right. So now you're trying to start this thing called the AAC. What what is the AAC about? Um uh it's um it stands for Air Guns Air Guns and Archery Club. Okay. And what do you do in the AAC? About the love of shooting. Um, we, we we accept different kinds of archery. Um, different. We accept air gunners of all different stripes. Um, it's about you know, it's about fun. It's about your know, sportsmanship. It's a sportsman's club, pretty much. It's um, our motto is um, sportsmanship, fellowship, fun. You know. No, it's no, it's no, it's no big mystery. I'm a part of this uh, organization, the AAC. Yeah. Um, yes. I joined what two weeks ago. Yeah. Um, how how big has the AAC grown since? It has uh, grown started? by leaps and bounds on Instagram, and this people want to join. Um, how do they join? 
Like if someone, if well, someone out there is interested, at this how do they currently, join? It currently, this, it currently right now, uh, we just say welcome aboard. In the future, we'll probably do something for membership and stuff like that. You know, maybe some some type of you know maybe some type of charity thing or you know pay for a T-shirt or some type of membership package. I don't know. Um, you know, just I'm not gonna. I maybe not a membership package, but just you know T-shirts and stuff like that. We're gonna have merchandise, you know what I mean? But me, you know, we'll we'll just basically you know look at what you do, you know what I mean? See if you're into part of the criteria is you have to be into shootings like something, you know, like a slingshot, a bow, a crossbow, air gun, um, something like that. You know I mean? Now, the reason we exclude firearms for the most part is because, well, you know, we're do, it's air guns and archery club. You know what I mean, mm -hmm. you know, now people are going to say, what about shooting loads? You're going to shooting loads. What are you talking about? It don't matter. So, if I if someone wants to get in touch with you, uh, how do they how do they do this? How do they become part of the? Uh, they just AAC? contact me on YouTube or Instagram. We have a big group, uh, Instagram group right now. Um, I have recruited even a world class author, um, uh, the guy who beat Lars Anderson. You know, uh, you know his name. I forget his name. Um, uh. Sometimes I, I don't remember names very well. I'm subscribed to his channel. He's basically a speed archer. No, man. Um, no, you're not shooting dildos, uh, Dorian. Not shooting dildos. This is a this is a shooting uh, club that again we're what is what is the motto again? We're in friendship, uh, reality, uh, no, sportsmanship, uh, sports sportsmanship, fellowship, fun. Mm. Okay. And if anybody wants to go out and become part oh, of this yeah. organization. Now I remember his name, Max Tactical Archery. Check out his channel. Max Tactical Archery. Now he's part of the AAC. He's supporting the AAC. He's part of the AAC. Yeah. How many people? Yeah. Uh, what did you say? You, you skipped out a little bit for a second. How many members in total do you have? I think we're getting, we're trailing close to maybe about. 60, you know what I mean? I think, give or take, you know. Uh, we got a lot of people who want to join. Um, uh, 60. Because, yeah. Six zero. wow. And these, these are people from all over the United States, um, all over the country. All, are you all over taking, the world. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was going to say, you're taking applications from all over the world. Oh, yes. So now when you do this, are you going to be opening up chapters, stuff like that? Yeah, that's what we're planning on doing. Open up chapters A of the AAC. Our motto is we're for we're a sportsman club first. We will teach a little self-defense, maybe with air guns, like some of the launchers and stuff like that. But we're not primary that's not our primary goal. It's basically about having fun and shooting together, maybe going on hunting trips and stuff like that. Um, you know, just basically um sportsman hunting, uh doing a shoot shooting targets you know and um you know that's primarily what we're doing now can can women join this it looks like uh oh, Dorian Gray is women need to learn how to defend themselves now there are air guns that are out there if you cannot if if you ladies oh don't want to own a don't want to basically uh, go through the whole a rigmarole of you know like um background checks for a firearm um there's these um pcp uh, air rifles and air pistols and less lethal launchers that you can get without any kind of background check. nothing all right so is dorian is dorian now a part of the aac uh dorian um what did she say i forgot she wants to know what she gets uh well at the in the future we're gonna have t-shirts hats um buttons um we all we i have a new um basically a logo for the archers you know man for the a, new aac logo for the archers you know just for the um, archers yeah we, we're working on different logos as you know we've i've been uh i have a friend who uh edward who makes the um logos 
Uh, are you impressed with the logos? Mm-hmm. Well, can we see them? Do you have any on you right now or no? Not on, well, not on me. Um, maybe, uh, you know, on my YouTube page. Yeah. Um, yeah. All right. So where, where can they find, where can they find this on your, on your YouTube channel, your Instagram channel? Yeah. My Instagram and, um, you can find it on my Instagram page, my Instagram profile and my YouTube. Um, you know, let's see. Um, I'm about to go to it now. Um, community page. You know, I just put up the new logo for my community page. You know? I put it on my uh, the new logo for my community page. Yeah, it's something I'm working on, you know. Um, from the first logo was an air gunner. The second logo uh, is basically an archer, you know. So it's showing that we run the gamut. And yet our motto is, again, sportsmanship, fellowship, fun. You know? Now, Yosemite Sam is calling you a dork. Yosemite Sam, a, 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 real, a big question for you. Why, why would you call this guy a dork? Well, because he's getting into, like, something that, you know, maybe you're not interested in. I mean, this guy, l- 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 let me tell you something about Justin, okay? J- Justin's a guy who wants to be part of something all right he tried to be and it seems like he he didn't he didn't find it so he's creating his own thing he's nope. creating his own thing there's no reason to be calling justin a dork or anything like that justin i think you're well, doing fine you're 60 way, people, you're dealing- wait 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 60 people 60 people have signed up to be part of this organization all right yeah. why would you call him that you're calling you're calling 60 people dorks well, I would say this: if you're dealing with speed archers, you wouldn't call them dorks because they can launch arrows pretty fast. You know what I mean? Yeah. And the, a lot of these air guns are pretty um, they're not toys. You know what I mean? And you know that, uh, Dave. A lot of these air guns, they're not toys. You know. American Airlines Center, Dallas, Texas. I don't know what this is about right here. I have no idea. No idea. I don't know. I mean, uh, Nick, are you are you wanting to become? part of the AAC. And again, we, uh, it seems like, uh, he's part of that. He's in the Dallas, Texas area. Maybe he yeah. can open up a chapter in Dallas, Texas. Yeah, exactly. Thank you. And Justin, what does this stand for again? AAC air gun, air guns and archery club. There you go. And we're a club and it's all about fellowship, you know, getting together with a common love of shooting, you know, you know, it's that also all it's about, you know. Well, then uh, you so many Sam, uh, why why are you here? Yeah. Why are you much. here? Why are you here, man? Because a lot of the guys in my club, one of the guys in my club, you wouldn't call a dork who was face. And one of the guys is pretty um, tough. I'll put it that way. And I'm pretty tough myself. but. Uh, I there's, mean, a whole, there's a whole plethora of, of people there. Tough guys yeah. all the way down to Dorian Gray. All the way down yeah. to Dorian Gray. Yeah. I would say it doesn't matter how tough you are when someone pulls the trigger. You know what I mean? Or pulls back a bow. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know? Nick Johnson says, uh, Sam, those guns are cool. And again, they're, you're talking thank about you. air guns, right? Air guns. Well, thank you. Thank you, uh, Nick Johnson. Um, yes, they're, they're, these air guns are cool. There's two types that I uh, mess around with, less lethal and PCP. And that's not the drug people. That's pre-charged pneumatic. And that has firearm power. And you've seen the power of these PCP air rifles, um, Dave. Yes. Yes, I have. Unfortunately, it's like, uh, you know... I mean, I mean, as a, as a as a firearms enthusiast and a supporter of the Second Amendment, um, I do I do find these things fascinating. I, I find them uh, very um, versatile, whatever. But it just seems like you got to load them up one at a time. Are there any ones that like shoot like full auto no. or anything? Oh no, you don't have to load them up one time. They have magazines, dude. Oh, have you seen the Hots and Blitz? You could put an extended mag on that bad boy. Why don't you explain to the audience what the what a Hudson Blitz is? 
it's the AK-47 of air rifles, pretty much. It's uh, got firearm power. It, with an extended mag, you'll get like um, you know, like 30 caliber pellets. Um, these pellets are about this size. Uh, with an extended mag, um, you'll um, you'll basically uh, it'll basically um, you'll get I think about 60 uh, 60 pellets launched at uh, high velocity. Mm -hmm. You know. Um, so yes, a lot of these. I don't know what air guns you've seen, but they have magazines too. Are are uh, people I'm, are people hunting with these uh with these air rifles? Oh yes, oh yes, big game too. Um, there's the AA Zeus, um, the Humorex uh, Hammer. People have these are big bore air rifles. They can take down bears, bison. You know, people have hunted big game with these. And how and how much and how much are people uh, paying for things like this? Like. Like what, some what of them are more expensive than others. Some of them can be as expensive as firearms. Some of them are cheaper than others. Just like firearms. Okay, can we get like a like a like a roundup of a number or something? Uh, around a thousand to let's say a, a hundred. You know, thousand to hundred dollars to a thousand dollars, depending yeah. on what you buy. Wow. Exactly. And how do you charge these things? Uh, you have use either use like something like a bicycle pump, you know, by hand, or you get an electric pump, um, and you can have an extra tank, uh, just in case your air goes low that you can carry with you in the field. You know what, I mean? what does what does Slingshot Warrior use? Uh, I use a brake barrel currently, but I want to get a PCP. Um, my brake barrel is one thousand FPS. It's twenty two caliber pellets. Oh wow. What, what can you what can you take down with that? I can take down um, with a well with good shot placement. I could take down a deer. You know what I mean? Oh, you know. Um, I could also take down something as large as a coyote. You know what I mean? Wow. Or even a dog. You know what I mean? Wow. At hundred yards, I can even if I if if there was a situation like that, a self defense situation only. I could take down a human being. You know what I mean? Well, that's not the reason why we're buying them. That's not the reason why we're in the club, correct? That's not the reason. No. And what is the reason why we're in the club? For the love of shooting. Mm -hmm. To learn how to shoot. You know what I mean? And with and with shooting and all this stuff comes respect, comes, you know, responsibility, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera correct? Yeah. Right, you're out of here. You're banned. Oh, we got an AAC an AAC member right here, Lollipop Guild. <laughs> How you I mean, doing, do we, Lollipop? Do we have any kind of salute, special salute that we that we do when we run into uh, other AAC no. members? No, we just you know we greet each other. I just say what if you did if you love shooting, welcome to AAC. No man, we go out shooting, we have fun. I think eventually we're going to go offline. We're going to build, we're going to get places like club, sorry, club, you know, our own clubhouses, you know, I mean, and where, where's the first clubhouse going to, going to be, um, I guess, uh, established. Right down. <laughs> so, um, so does that mean that me and lollipop guild have to travel down to Maryland to, you know, to go to these meetings or. Yeah, I guess so. In your state, it's going to be very difficult, you know, because of all the restrictions you have. You know, what I mean? you know, I just, I just feel like maybe we could probably just do it online. Yeah, I'm you know, like maybe, yeah, maybe you can just like send links, and we could have, um, you know, you can give speeches or lectures about the AAC and where we're moving forward and what we're doing, you know, et cetera. Yeah. yeah. Of course. Now we accept all forms of archery in the AC, including slingshots. Slingshots are a form of archery, and you don't underestimate them. They can be, they can cause some serious damage. Some of them can, you know. Mm -hmm. With well, with well shot placement, I've not lived that through that. <laughs> no, yeah, that. Are, are, what if, what if, what if, like, what if someone is um, not able to own a firearm? Are you still going to be allowing them into the AAC? 
Well, we're Air Guns and Archery Club. Right. Of course. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, this is fascinating, Justin. Um, is there anything else you want to talk about? Nothing. Um, not really. Um, I've been doing well. Anything in the future? Well, in the future, I want to get a dog, and I'm going to get a dog. I'm still going to do that. I just had to get my money up, and I got my money up, and I want to adopt a dog. And um, <laughs> sideways. <laughs> I think this is the dog you want to adopt, right? This one right here? <laughs> funky eyes. I think it's funky eyes. Yeah. It's like cartoon character, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Very cute. All right. So again, Justin, how do people get in touch with you to join the AAC? You can contact me on Instagram or, or you can contact me on Instagram or here on YouTube. You know, I do live streams daily. Nope, never. I don't hunt dogs. I'll hunt deer. I'll hunt, um, I'll hunt, uh, you know, maybe a wild hog or even bear. You know what I mean, what is your what is the fantasy animal that you want to like hunt? Like, if you, if you can hunt any animal right now, what what animal would it be? Hmm. What would it be? I think a wild hog would be nice. You know, big wild boar with tusk. You know what I mean? Hold on, we're gonna we're gonna see if we can get someone up here someone who might want to talk about joining the aac or something like that yeah let's paste this can the aac grow into something bigger like the wagner group what is the wagner group i think they're a bunch of like soviet uh mercenaries or something like that no we don't want to do that here no man yeah, this We're isn't a militia, guys. This isn't a militia. This isn't anything like that. This is a, a sportsman's club. Sportsman's yeah. club. Yeah, we're all about art. You know, about, you know, you know what our motto is, you know? Um, I was in that kind. I, I was there. Was, I was being re recruited for that concept. They just, no, I don't want any more to do with that kind of shit. You know what I mean? And what is the motto? um it's uh very simple um sportsmanship fellowship fun mm -hmm. what is, is that supposed to mean dorian what is that uh, dorian it's not an exclusive men's club dorian it's for women and men but the women will be I don't, I don't i don't remember fellowship being a word that was exclusive to men um um women have fellowship with them with other women do they not oh justin i think i think nick johnson wants you to drop the drop your link in the chat for to get in touch with you know, i'm not sure if i can oh, um okay. well tell him where to go it's slingshot warrior on youtube um yeah i'm slingshot warrior on youtube um My account, probably not. That's trolling. But you're not getting my account, buddy. Mm. No. Lollipop Guild wants to know, is there a song, a theme song for the group? Have you picked one out? Not that I know of. I wasn't even thinking about doing anything like that. Is there um, like a pledge to the to the club? Something like that? Not yet. Um I was working on like low Logans and 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 the, I want to try merchandising first. You know what I mean, Dorian Gray wants to know: Is there a mascot? No, not yet. There could be. Um, uh, right now, we have logos. You know what I mean, um, well, I want to work on getting uh, merchandise made, like T-shirts, hats. Um, uh buttons you know you know uh join the aac buttons and stuff like that and um 
uh, even um, you know other things like book bag or you know something like that. Here is the link, Nick Johnson, to the channel right here. Dropping the link to the channel yeah. right there. Uh, no, Dorian. No, Dorian. You're not going to get a dildo. It's not going to happen. Dor Dorian keeps asking for these dildos. I don't know what her problem is. Is Dorian an actual woman? Mm, I yeah. don't think women. I've seen Dorian's sexy legs. Dex she's got sexy legs. She's got a dirty mind. Mm -hmm. An official AAC cologne would be nice. It says Lollipop Guild. Lollipop Guild, you are in the AAC. What fragrance would you think would represent the AAC the best? Dracar? Cool water? I would say something like backcountry or something like that, you know? Okay, backcountry cologne. Backcountry cologne. I thought the mascot would be a dildo. No. Come on. Let me see if I can go to Justin's page and get the um and get the actual thing. Hold on, Justin. Okay. You talk to them, Justin. Well, the AC is uh, breaking ground and uh, it's doing well. And for those trolls like Dorian, who wants to have, which you have a nasty mind, by the way. I mean, I mean, I'm I'm pretty much wondering if you're kind of a cat lady right now, just. You know, <laughs> but anyway, um, the point is here is that we're doing what we can. And no offense, Dorian, but it's kind of weird. You know what I mean? Um, you know. All right, here's the AAC logo right here. That's obviously a, a man with a pellet gun uh, shooting Actually, that's a, that's a PCP air rifle. Right? Uh, with a PCP air rifle, with a target, everything. And that's that's the official logo? Uh, yeah. We made another one, an archery version of it. You know I mean? Oh, really? Red one. You know I mean? Just oh, recently. That? Is it on your page? Yeah. I just put it up. Turn on the light. There we go. Okay, let me get this up there. And this is like kind of you're trying to get like females involved, right? I mean, that's a woman with a bow and arrow right there. Yeah, could be. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There you go, Dorian. There you go. That's the AAC. AAC. Yeah. Now. Our you know, archery is, um, there's women's archery, there's men's archery. It's um, between teams of the Olympics. You know what I mean? I don't, I don't need those kind of comments in here, Rick. I don't need those kind of comments. Okay. <sighs> no, not body odor. What did you say it was? Backdoor or back, um, backwoods a clone or something like that? Yeah, um, yeah, backcountry. I used to have a cologne like that called, you no, know, I think it was Wild Country. Yeah, it was Wild Country. Will the, will the AAC entertain a float in the next local parade? That would be a sight to see. I'd march proud behind it. That would be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> what would it be? Mm, I don't know. Um, what? I think it would be some, you know, somebody, someone carrying a bow, you know, someone carrying a, an air rifle, someone carrying a slingshot. You know I mean? Okay, so do we want to get into the reason why you left your other community? I mean, do we want to disassociate with those people? I mean, so here's the thing. All right, as you guys know, Justin was a part of Tac Fam. Okay, yeah. Tac Fam was an organization. That he's no longer involved with and no slight here nothing like that 
you just you just fell out of love with the organization or do you think it was going the wrong direction or, yeah like, i just think that uh the concept of militia was just asking for trouble i mean and the fact that they were trying to tell me what i can put on my my on my own channel yeah yeah nick johnson I, i've known justin justin how long have i known you for like four years yeah yeah i've known justin for four years um let, let's give a little background on justin uh J justin you're on the spectrum correct yes All right. justin's on the spectrum guys i met justin through a rally that he was holding um on youtube it was an anti-vax rally back in uh, i don't even remember what year it was i went down to maryland i met up with him and unfortunately i was the only one that showed up um i think a lot of people just couldn't make it that day whatever blah 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 we did the we did our protest and uh i've been friends with you ever since correct yeah exactly yeah so you know guys it's success on the spectrum justin wants to be part of something and he tried he tried with tac fam he didn't like it he didn't like where it was going so the next best thing to do was to create the aac all right yeah, that, that's it. And that's what we're supporting here. Justin is trying to create a community for air gun enthusiasts, um, uh, slingshot enthusiasts, archery enthusiasts. And uh, you, you are pretty much well known in the community, correct? And the, uh, those various communities, yes. Yeah. Yeah, it was great, Lollipop. It was great. Yeah. And you were also the inventor of Wolf Energy, correct? I was. Yeah. Justin had a thing called Wolf Energy a few a few years back. Um, it became very popular and it, I wouldn't put it past them to do another thing of uh, popularity like the AAC. I think the AAC could possibly be one of the greatest things uh, to ever come out of your mind or out of your mouth. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. The AAC is just basically it's not about, you know, anything political or anything like that. It's like if you just like shooting, what's wrong with that? Nick Johnson. Yeah. Fascinating. Nick Johnson says tyrants tell you what you can post. Forget TAC fam. Fuck um, TAC fam. Fuck. Well, we're not talking bad about TAC fam. Um, no, we're doing now. I don't give a shit. Those people, I, at this point, I don't care um, after what happened. I'm not going to say nothing that happened before. Let's just say something I, I'm not going to say. But fuck them. I, I can't say that anything less. You know what I mean? They are that, that, that son of a bitch is horrible. You know what I mean? You know? Well, I, you know, again, you know, let, let's calm down because you guys might be, you guys might just like have a difference of opinion and things can go on. You don't no, have that to person get... is an evil as shit. You know what I mean? You know? Well, I I never knew the guy. I never met him. Um, I didn't know what was going on over there. I kind of stayed away because it kind of seemed like I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. It kind of seemed like it was it was an organization that was meant to if you if you were in that organization, you were representing that organization. And the reason why I say this is because the reason why I never ever got um, baptized with the witnesses was because when you're a witness you're representing an organization all right i didn't want to ruin that guy's organization i didn't want to represent that guy's organization or make that guy's organization look terrible so again that's why we never talked about it that's why i was never really involved with it but as you know i'm a big supporter of you and what you want to do thank you mm -hmm. i support you um creating this community i just don't support you getting in drama with these people that's what I'm, that's what I'm too talking. late for that anyway um um anyway the point is here i want to do this positive aac you know man now there there, there will there will never be okay because we want to we want to point this out that there will never be any beef between the aac and tac fam correct correct all right, so like we won't be going to war with TAC fam or anything like that, right? No, we're a completely different type of group than what they represent. You know what I mean? And you're not saying that everyone who is affiliated with TAC fam are bad people, correct? Not everyone, no. 
All right, it's you just, just don't the, get you just, just don't get along with someone right now. Yeah, okay, All right. it's just the leader is a piece of shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Are we talking about the weird, imposing, uh, monotone uh, voice guy? Well, I, I don't know, Justin. Are you still friends with that guy? The guy that you had on your channel, the guy from Texas, I think he was, like that was shooting the coconuts. And they were exploding. No, I won't talk to him no more either. Really? Yeah. Okay. So I don't know. I don't know what to do with this, Justin. I don't know. Like, you know, I don't want to cause any problems with you guys. It's no problem. Look, let's just get back to the AC. I'm sorry. Yeah. Go on. Got a little angry. You know what I mean? You know, well, 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 why don't you why don't you tell us that you know people out there that might want to join TAC Fam or might want to join the AAC? What's the difference in the organizations? TAC Fam will tell, try to tell you what to do. They're trying to be like military army. You know, they're trying to be like um, a militia, like an air gun militia, and he's trying to basically get like a. He's trying to get like a compound where everyone lives on it. Really weird. Really bizarre. No man. So wait, they're gonna they're gonna move you to this compound? Yeah, he wants us to move this this compound. You know, he was gonna buy land. It was really weird. No, I mean it was really bizarre. Um, you know, I was like even. Um, That's that's kind of weird. I, I mean, I mean, was he gonna allow people's family members to move there? Like, you just had to like go out there by yourself, or it's kind of strange. Yeah, it was a bizarre scenario that he was painting. You know. Uh, All right, so so there's none of that with the AAC. The AAC isn't about that. The AAC is like kind of like about freedom, do whatever you want. Uh, but do it responsibly. I mean, wh where do you draw the line with the AAC? Uh, the AAC and 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 the way people act or what they do. I mean, will there be any repercussions for people that maybe get out of line? You know, stuff like that. Be respectful of others. We don't let people in that are not respectful of others. Yeah. You know. Yeah, lollipop. It does. It does start to sound like that. And that was that was another thing. Like, I like. I get. I get what it's about. I, I get it. All right. Um, I don't. I don't want to talk bad about these people. I don't. I don't know them, dude. You know. I mean, why? Why? Why would you tell someone to maybe be cautious of TAC fam? I don't know. Be cautious because they're calling themselves a militia. You want to get on the Fed's radar? It's way to get it, you know, man. Um, and if you want, basically, you know, this guy is very dangerous. I would say that. I mean, this guy. Um, you don't want to make contact with this guy ever in person, ever. You no, know, man. He's a very dangerous. He's a, he's a felon. He is a, a thug. You know. Do you, do you know nice for person. sure? I mean, do you? Know I know for people? sure. Mm -hmm. And, and 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 for the record, guys, like I don't know this guy. I, I never. I talked to him a couple times. He seemed like an alright guy, a decent guy. Um, you know, I'm not trying to cause any issues with Tac Fam or any other people or anything like that. But um, th this is a specific reason for why I'm also supporting Justin with this. I, I want Justin to be to be safe and to be happy in in, in something that he's doing. Um, yeah. And you know, Justin. Sometimes when you get involved with certain people, they're they're nice to you. They want you to come in. They're like, "Yeah, hey, don't worry about it." Blah blah blah. And then they then they start getting a little rough. You know, is that is that the case of what happened over there? Where, yeah. Yeah. Now, did did you ever have to pay money to get into this organization? There was a membership fee, but then I was going to join. I'll tell you this. Until I started to realize they wanted me to basically control my channel and they were telling me what I can and can't put on my channel. I said, you know what? 
screw this. I said, just give me my money back. I don't want anything more to do with this organization. Mm -hmm. And I left it. How much money? If you don't mind me asking. I got my money back. Don't worry about that. Yeah. He's a self-admitted criminal. 12 kids by 10 different mamas. Just the POS. Um, you know, I mean, people, listen, Nancy, people lie on, on social media all the time. I don't know the guy. I don't even know his name. I don't know whatever. All I know is that people have come out against him. And, you know, I want him to have an organization. I want him to be able to run a club, uh, whatever, whatever he's entitled it's to not do. A club. It is not a club. He's trying to run it like a military organization. He's never been in the military. No, man. Like, what, was, was he make, was he making you, like, do weird things, or was it like... No, no. Well, no, uh, not necessarily weird things, but he was just trying to basically, uh, like, be, like, a military, kind of paramilitary commander and a cult leader at the same time. He, he lacks charisma, but he has a few, he has only a few members in his club. I have ever seen. I mean, only a few. Um, I have grown in, in members because I don't do things like that. I don't like you know, tell people what to do in the club. Um, I, I've been a pretty good leader so far, and not a lot. And the, the video chats I have with various people from different parts of the country and world has been very peaceful and nice. I mean. All right, well, I'm, I'm going to be fair about this because maybe there are TAC fam supporters out there and maybe, you know, maybe you just got a bad taste for TAC fam. We're going to put the StreamYard link out. Maybe a TAC fam member will, will come up and maybe, you know, talk about this or whatever. But um, your experience with TAC fam wasn't that great. So you left TAC fam. Um, was, were they telling you what to do with your channel? Were they telling oh, yeah. you what to do? And that's where I drew the line. Mm. Lollipop, we don't want to get it. We don't want to get it to that to that point. We want we want peace with TAC Fam. The AAC is not causing any issues for TAC Fam. Um, we're a Christian we're Christian based organization. Yeah, and we we love the brothers and sisters over at TAC Fam, right, Justin? Except one, I can say I've tried to forgive him. You know, man, I'm being a Christian. I'll, I'll forgive him. Well, why don't we forgive him right now? Why don't we declare uh, forgiveness? I forgive Dwayne Stacks. Hmm. Okay. And what do you, what are we forgiving him for? Being an asshole. Hmm. For being a thug. Hmm. Is there any way that maybe this guy and you could possibly do a live stream and hash it no. out? No. Mm. Trust me, we burned our bridges with each other. Well, lollipop, I don't think that's a good idea. I don't think that's a good idea. Um, again, I think that what Justin's describing is a gung ho, well organized um, a militia that might actually um, be. They're not that organized, to be honest with you. Um, there are a few members, and basically, it's all online. Well, how many members were there? Last time, I would think about eight. You know, I've only seen eight. And, mo I, and mostly, the mo I only see about maybe five. I was the sixth member, and people come back and forth through TACFAM, and that's about it. You know, is there anything good you can say about Tac Fam instead of like you know the bad things? I mean, what what was good about Tac Fam? Things that maybe you... first. It was fun at first. I mean, you know, and then it became you know it was fun at first. You know, being a part of something. You know, then you know it got a little when it started to establish itself. You know, you know power tripping started happening. You know. Like what kind of power trips? Oh, I'm going to describe it. Um, I'm going to be this honest. This guy with is you. very violent, and he makes violent threats. I'll put it that way. You know what I mean, 
I'm no. not going to. And I literally, um, I, was, I said, no, I'm going. No, man. Because I'm, I'm going to be completely honest with you. I think that once you become a head of an organization, you're going to have to kind of be kind of like not a tyrant, but like more of like a, um, a public figure to the point where it's like, listen, guys, you're representing my organization. We're all a part of this. Um, you might have to start telling people what to do. I mean, what if what if Lollipop Guild one day um, goes at a TAC fan member? I don't know. But I doubt that would happen. But here's the point. I might smile a little bit, but anyway. Anyway, um, the point is here is that um, I started the AAC as a positive club. I'm sorry I was a little angry at, at the beginning. I'm sorry. I cussed, you know. But, uh, yeah, I have a lot of bitterness, and I shouldn't have that, but, you know. Bitterness. What, is, what does that mean? Explain to the audience. Bitterness, you know, towards a third, the leader of that group. Mm -hmm. All right. So, so guys, just so we're clear here, there, there's kind of like a, a, a rift between not the AAC members and not the TAC fam members. Um, it's kind of between Justin and the head organizer of this place. And uh, again, we, we want peace. We want this to be a, a peaceful or, or organization. And maybe yeah. in the future, maybe in the future we can do, um, we can have rallies with TAC fam and maybe do some kind of, you know, um, you know, I don't know, toys for tots type stuff. I don't know. You think there's no. ever? No, that's never going to happen. Hmm. You know, uh, lollipop guild. M maybe you can simmer lollipop guild down. Lollipop guild is getting very angry right now, saying that he is tending uh, his steel as we as he, as we speak. At this point, I would say go for it. <laughs> right now. So you're telling Lollipop Guild to go after this guy? Trolling wise, I would say, yeah. No, no, come on. Come on. You're right. You're right. But I would be careful if you get involved with this guy. This guy's very violent, he makes violent threats, he's very dangerous. You do not want to be around this person. You know? Oh, my God. Nancy, Nancy, put, put the sword back in its place. This is getting out of control. This is, this is, getting, this is getting, like, toward, um, you know. Uh, Justin, I, I'm telling you, you got you to you quell this right now. I'm telling you. Quell this Don't. right now. Tell Nancy. Nancy's, a, Nancy's an AAC member. Lollipop's an AAC member. Um, Nancy Drew, I mean, I'm sorry, um, uh, Jack, uh, Nick Jackson or Nick Johnson and Dorian, quell them. I would say don't go after them, um, but let's just build this club and have a good time. You know, man? All right. We're 60 strong and TAC fam is only eight. Yeah. Wow. I mean, they wouldn't have a chance anyway, but. The thing is, they're not going anywhere. It doesn't appeal to most people. Um, and, yeah. I could see that club going nowhere. Well, I mean, it appealed to you. At first, but then again, at first, it appeals to certain people. Then you have to deal with, you know, Dwayne Stacks. And Dwayne Stacks is not a nice person. What 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 brought you into that to that club or that, that organization? Like, what, what made you feel like you were... It started out with me talking to the guy because I'm an air gunner, right? And we're uh, and he's an air gunner, and, I, and basically I brought him onto my stream because I got a lot of people who called me a racist. You know what I mean, before in the past, you know that, right? Yes, because you 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 guys were you guys were good friends. I mean, I didn't I didn't see you guys ever having a problem. This is what this is what kind of bothers me about it. I was kind of I was kind of pushing for this, dude. I I, I thought. I thought you felt 
like you were part of something and i thought you felt like this guy was i mean you wanted to go out there you wanted to go visit the guy multiple times not anymore hmm. i'd rather go see you man i would rather i'd rather go to pennsylvania yeah i would rather go to west virginia you know what i mean yeah to go go see to yeah you know no, I'm sorry, dude. I really am. And the day that you told me that you were leaving the organization, I, I felt I felt bad for you. And then when you told me why, I kind of understood, and I still felt bad. But you know, what, what if what if what if Tac Fam reaches out to you and says, "Listen, you're right about this, Justin. We want to give you a higher position in the Tac Fam organization." No, we're totally no, no. Mm. I want nothing more to do with that. That that. That is a dangerous organization, and I think anyone who gets involved with it, any air gunner who gets involved with it, you do not. It's um, you're going to get yourself into trouble. I, I have a feeling that that there's bad things coming because of the things that they're doing. You know what I mean, calling well, what, themselves what? a list. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So, are you afraid that TAC Fam is going to try to uh, infiltrate the AAC? No, the moles. they don't want it. I, I, it's a possibility, but I doubt it. See, I, I recruit new talent. You know, man. You know, and I got Max Tactical Archery, the guy who beat uh, Lord Anderson in a speed archery contest, American Archer. You know, man. Okay. I've got um, several other people. I even got a someone who was was going to join Tac Fan, and we I made friends with them. And he didn't like the guy, and I can understand why. We were talking to each other, and I was giving advice. I was being nice to the guy. I was asking about air gun questions, and they, um, you know, Wayne got all pissed off because he wasn't the center of attention, and got rude with the guy. And this and they, is this is the the head the head leader of Tac Fam. This is the, yeah, Dwayne Stacks is his name. Mm -hmm. All right, so Dwayne got mad at who for what? Basically, because he wasn't the center of attention. But who did he get mad at? Uh, I don't understand who the hell you're talking. Started about. yelling and screaming, basically, and he almost he pissed off this guy that he pissed off. Um, it almost got bad. You no know, man. Who's this we, guy? This, but this guy's a friend of mine. I'm not going to mention his name. Oh. He's on YouTube. Well, he's also on Instagram. Um, you'll meet him, um, but um, I'll put it this way: he's now a member of the AAC. Um, we we're good friends, but yeah, yeah. So did, how did how did you how did you meet? How did you get involved with Tac Fam? Just so we know. Like I said, it started out like this before Tac Fam was a thing. It he was endorsing this Tac Fam thing. It was in early stages. You know what I mean? Yeah, but where did you meet him? Through uh, Rune Rebel, mm. and he uh, gave links to his channel. Um, I regret ever meeting him, to be honest with you. you no know, man, um, you know, and um, you know, I wish I never met him. You know, man? Um, and I started talking to him, and we, I left a few comments saying, on his videos, and then I asked him, you know, if you want to come up. You know, you want to you want to come up to my channel and do a stream that's how it started and because i brought him up for one reason a lot of the trolls like to say i'm racist you know what I mean? so i showed him so i showed i brought a black prepper up you know now some people some people would claim that that was like a token uh, black guy that you're bringing up like to kind of make people feel like you weren't racist i mean were you using tac fam like that were you using tac fam no, no i want to show people that I could befriend anybody. See, I'm a Christian. I don't believe, I don't think the color of your skin really matters at the end of the day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, of you course know? not, but, you know, I mean, you weren't using this guy in any way to, to, to sway people to believe that you weren't racist or anything like that, right? No, no. But I was showing them that, you know, I'm a Christian. I, keep, I kept telling them it doesn't really matter the color of your skin. It matters what your soul is. You know what I mean? Is what is the see? AAC a Christian organization or just like Christian? Well, uh, it's Christian affiliated. 
you could say. Um, um, we will accept uh, different, I think uh, we'll accept different kinds of people, you know. Um, yeah, we're kind of Christian. Yeah, we're kind of Christian a little bit. Uh, the values are, you know, with, no, man. Um, but we're not completely Christian. We're just basically talk, talking to people. And um, we basically just went on some fellowship. It's all about the shooting most of the time at the end of the day. No, man. So an AAC member comes across a TAC fan member online. What do you suggest they do? How do you suggest they act? Um, what do you, what do you, what do you want the AAC to, uh, how do you want the AAC re to respond to, uh, TAC fam? Just to basically, I would not respond to them. No, man. You know, what does that mean? Ignore them? Well, I would not follow any of their content or nothing. No, man. Okay. All right. Excellent. Uh, Lollipop Gill says AAC is in league with the Knights Templar. Is that true? <laughs> well, oh, where did they come up with this shit? I'm like, whoa. All right, do we We're want to shooting club? Yeah, are we going to demote um, uh, Lollipop Guild now because he's. He's acting trolling. Yeah. trolling pretty much, I would say. Lollipop Gill, it's not cool. It's not cool. In fact, I think that Lollipop Gill should be demoted. Now, what what am I in the AAC? What am I? Do I have a rank? Do I have a uh We don't do that there? It's a club. It's not a you know, it's basically a social club. We don't have ranks. Um yeah, but if yeah. you're running chapters, there has to be a, there has to be ranks. Oh yeah, there. there's club, there's club presidents, and there's basically you know, uh, like like treasurers and stuff like that. You know, your basic stuff in any club, you know, even treasurers, you know, and um, uh, right, well. you know, like like uh, shooting coaches or something like that. You know, you know, man. Well, I'm very, I'm very much into the AAC. I'm glad that I've, I've become a member, et cetera. What is the future for the AAC? Well, uh, look, chapters and um, basically, and um, a meetup and uh, some shooting meetup where we'll shoot air guns, we'll shoot slingshots, we'll shoot bows and arrows, we'll shoot crossbows. No man. Okay, so um, like. Lollipop Guild, you're the only you're the only other member that I really know who's probably going to partake in this. Um, is it like do I do I have to like like when I meet Lollipop Guild? Is there like any kind of like secret handshake, you know, stuff like that? No, we don't do those things. Like, well, I don't don't you want to don't you want to do something fun? You know, I mean, that, it just kind of sounds like. Well, I guess we could. Um, I mean, it just kind of sounds about, like a bunch of dudes uh, meeting up and being like, hey, what's up? And we just uh, show up our, our slingshots and we just start plinking cans. Yeah. I mean, no, no offense, okay. but I, I could um, do that anyway. Some point. How about we can do like like that? I don't know. Like what? All right. that's Guys, that's it. And if you have if you've missed it, you are not part of the AAC. Like, achoo, achoo. <laughs> <laughs> Mind Blown Watcher says, sounds like a renaissance fair. What do you have to say about that? Well, not exactly, because we're not doing medieval stuff. Um, more like a, like, a, like, a, like a shooting tournament, I would say. Now, do you do you see the AAC like lasting like hundreds of years and possibly after your death or after your passing, and people like calling the AAC a bunch of uh, Justinites or something like that? I would hope not. No, man. I called it the AAC instead of TAC fam because I didn't want to be about me or me particular, just about the shooting. No, man. Yeah. Tac Fam is basically big tactical. Oh, man. Okay. Which is Dwayne Stacks. Oh, man. So I'm like, 
Now, I'm not going to call the club SSW Club or nothing like that, so I ain't doing that. No, man. Um, that's why I call it the AAC is because it um, it's not about me. It's not about ego. No, man. Um, it's it's about the shooting. It's about the air guns. It's about the archery. You know, it's about the it's about the um the fellowship. You know. No, this is not. Grizz is live right now, and I sent the chairman his panel link. Now he's really, really moose. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, what about people with disabilities, like people in wheelchairs, people that are maybe missing arms and feet and stuff like that? Of course that? Are they, they can come. Of course they can come. We accept those people in the AAC. Women, children, dyslexics. Yeah. All right. Anything else you want to say about the AAC, Justin? It's a good club to join, and um, and if you if you have a love of shooting like I do, and that's the only criteria right now is that you have to have a love of shooting or want to learn how to shoot something, like an air gun or archery, you know. An archery can be crossbow or bow and arrow or slingshot. I mean, now let's try to recruit some people right now. Moose, Moose, do you want do you want to be in the AAC? Moose, Planet Moose, do you want to be in the AAC? No, uh, that's your answer. Oh, he said 100. All okay. right. So you can, add, you can add Moose to the list. I can, can add him to the list. Does he shoot anything? No, he's either, did he do archery? He shoots, he shoots rope or something like that. I forget what he calls it. No, no, no. So, for instance, if someone's if someone's like on drugs or doing uh, alcohol, are they allowed to be part of the AC? I mean, no. All right. I want to be anywhere that I can be close to Justin, says uh, Planet Moose. Well, That's a little he, weird. Mm. Well, I mean, Justin is the face of the AAC, mm. right? Justin is the the owner operator of the AAC, and yep. yes, there probably will be people who will want to be part of this and blah blah blah. Okay. Um, Lollipop Gill says, I have a brand new, uh, Sapphire, or what is that? Sharpie. Oh, sorry. And believe me, I'm going to be tagging AAC in the most offbeat places. Thank you, Lollipop Gill. Okay. <laughs> I mean, how do you, how do you, how do you want people to spread the word about the AAC? Uh, go online, use our, um, use our, basically our. Our logos make flyers, you know. Okay, so guys, take the opportunity right now to get screenshots of the AAC logos. There's one yeah. right there, and here's another one. That's a good one. That's the archery one, yeah. And and here's another one. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. All right. Anything else, Justin? Well, that's it. All right, guys. Listen, you heard it. You heard it here first. Are you going to be going? Yeah. You know what, Mind Blown Watcher? We we talked about merch. Uh, he's thinking about doing hats, pins, buttons, stickers, patches, uh, t-shirts, etc. For yeah. the AAC. What about an AAC wrist wristwatch? Not the possibility, but I don't know who would make that. Yeah, you know what, Buff? What what about what about bladed weapons? Are we allowed to what about people who are into swords and katanas and stuff like that? It's a shooting club. Um though we do there's like that, maybe we have a few knife throwers in the AAC at this point, you know. But it's mostly a shooting club, so 
we might do those in the future, I guess, and but um, in martial arts capacity, yeah. Right, and the the official AAC clone is called Backdoor what or something. Well, I, I remember the name of the clone that I had. And I, I I gave it the wrong name. It's called Wild Country. Right? Wild Country. Can I get an AAC thong? I guess he's saying for his wife. Will we be making anything like that? Uh, that's a weird one. Mm. Um, um, Nick, Nick Johnson says, Justin was fun. Have him on more often. Yeah, so Nick, um, I don't know if you if you know, but Justin has his own channel. It's called Slingshot Warrior on YouTube. Yeah. And uh, you can also become a member of the AAC um, starting right now. Just pledge your yeah. allegiance. Yeah, but you, the criteria is you have to be into some kind of shooting. You know, like get a crossbow, bow and arrow, slingshot, air gun, you know. We might have a firearms division in the, in the AAC in the future, but. Any chance of an AAC karate a GI? I don't know what that means. A G. Oh. Uh, no, because we're, it's a different situation. You know what I mean? We're, it's a shooting club. I mean, that's what we're about. Yeah, Nick, Nick, I, I've known I've known Justin for four years. J Justin's down for a little bit of fun. He's he's down for a little bit of joking, but in in reality, the AAC is real. Um, and, and Justin, we're, this is this is a fun organization, right? This isn't like, you yeah, know. yeah, it's a fun organization. I mean, our our, our motto is basically uh, fellow is basically um, sportsmanship, um, fellowship, and fun. You know, man. I mean, who doesn't want to have fun, have fellowship, you know, with like-minded people who, who have share the similar kind of shooting hobby, you know? Mm -hmm. Now, Planet Moose says, uh, we would we would all call, we could all call Justin Sensei. Um, what do you think about that? Uh, no, nah, I'm just the president of the AAC. <laughs> okay. Now, now, can we kind of do like a, can you kind of like baptize everyone here as members? There's 21 people watching. Um, maybe well, we it depends on, like I said, they got to meet the criteria. Does anybody like to shoot anything? Or want to shoot anything? Thank you, Buff. Thank you, Buff. Maybe we can make Buff head of, uh, of um like relations well yeah i mean here's the thing um I, I have someone named edward making uh making like you know like logos perhaps you can make me something more you know like an animation style because you're pretty good at that you know why don't, we, um, why, don't we, why don't we give buff something say something uh, prolific say something exciting about the ac maybe use your hands like kind of like okay. yeah. The AC is all about sportsmanship, fellowship, and fun. <laughs> what are you doing, Dave? Sorry, sorry, sorry. All right, do it again, do it again, do it again. Sorry. The, the AAC is all about sportsmanship, fellowship, and fun. Excellent. Excellent. Yes, Justin might be the next um, uh, Hickok 45. Yep. Um, I shot my chicken today, says uh, Planet Moose. I think Planet Moose actually had to put down one of his chickens. So, sorry. Okay. I'm sorry you had to do that, Planet Moose. Sorry. Yes. Okay, so can we baptize these people in the AAC? Everyone, I mean, everyone here seems like they're pretty much, you know, into the AAC. Awesome. Well, I guess they like uh, the fun of shooting and stuff like that. Who doesn't like to shoot stuff? You know, it's fun. Mm. Can you set off Tannerite with um with a Hux a Hux and Blux or whatever the hell it's called? You wouldn't need to. The thing has firearm power. I mean, it's like it will just like 
Yeah, there's you got magazines attached to these, you know. Yeah. Cuz maybe we can like make like a Tac Fam logo and just like put like Tannerite in it and just like blow it up. Nah, we're using our own logos. But yeah. I I'll have to get uh buff, buff uh working with my friend from Wh- from Wales at work. You know what I mean? <laughs> I think those but, Butthole Whisperer says I'm interested in joining. What are the benefits? Well, you have fellowship and you get to shoot, shoot. We can do some hunting trips and shooting to, you know, uh, we do, um, we just have fun. You know, the benefits are you have fun, you shoot, you practice and you learn from each other. I mean, Buff Carrot says, will Wolf Energy be mixing with AAC? It's a little bit different than, than Wolf Energy. No, man. Butthole Whisperer says, can we call Justin Fuhrer? No. Mm. Thank you very much, Nick Johnson. Thank you so much. Thank you, Nick Johnson. God bless you. What are the group's policies on back rubs, says Moose, uh, Planet Moose? That's not going to happen. Mm, that's my policy. Mm. Okay. Brian PC says, yes, skills are important. Absolutely, Brian PC. Brian PC, do you want to be a part of the AAC? I think Brian PC would be a great um, uh, addition to the AAC. Does he want to learn to shoot or does he have his shooting skills already? You know? Once you get uh, monetized, you can do AAC memberships and do special teaching videos on how to shoot for beginners. Yes. Yeah, Max Tactical Archery does a lot of videos on that when it comes to speed archery. He actually beat um, Lars Anderson, in a, and uh, he's a world champion now of uh, speed archery, Max Tactical Archery. Chris 71 says, what's wrong with back rubs? Chris 270 has got a bad back. It's a shooting club, not a massage parlor. Mm-hmm. Planet Moose with some slight American anal worshippers community. All right, he's never going to be in the AAC. Never. Mm. Why, why don't we give him a ban for life? You're banned for life, yeah. uh, Moose. Ban for life. International ambassador, maybe, or measly role, uh, a, re- a measly role, maybe. We shall see, says Brian PC. Uh, Brian PC is overseas. Um, Brian, we are opening chapters all over the world. So, if you want to be a chapter, small work. I got basically I, I, I got a new shooter um, coming, all the way, a younger guy from Wales, Edward. He just bought his first slingshot. Lollipop Gill says the AAC has to get a school bus like the Turnbull ACs in the Warriors. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Buff Carrot says, "Will Noodles be meeting with Slingshot Warrior to make AAC content?" Uh, if that's a question for me, uh, I plan on it one hundred and ten percent. As far as I want to bring the AAC to Manhattan, I want to be honest with you. I want to bring the AAC to the biggest city in the world, Manhattan, New York, and I want you to go crazy um uh pushing this on people and making them understand that they have a right to have fun in shooting sports yeah planet moose says is the chairman allowed in the aac he he pretends to shoot too um well the chairman's kind of a jerk i, I don't think we're gonna have him around i, I would if there, it, justin is this like is this like democracy like can we like vote people in vote people out if people get out of control, they would have to go. I mean, it's like, you know, it's like anything else. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, the rules are you got to be like respectful of others and you got to basically have a love of shooting, you know, and basically you want to have to want to be there and you don't have, if you start trouble with others, yeah, you can get you kicked out. You know I mean? Brian PC says, okay, uh, this like and okay, this like and sound and nice. Amazing opportunity. I know a man who makes custom slingshots in Wales. There you awesome. go. Awesome. 
Well, Edward. I actually at my Edward just bought his first slingshot, and he's from Wales. <laughs> hmm. uh, banning an American hero sounds like a liberal move. Um, it's not that we're banning American heroes; we just don't want that type of that type of riffraff stuff like that. Mm. Um, Moose says, uh, "Yes." Does Justin know that I'm actually retired military? Well, I do thank you for your service, but you're acting kind of bizarre. No, man. Uh, Buff wants to know, are women allowed? I think we already went over this. Yes, women are allowed in the AAC. Well, it, Moose, Moose, um, you called it the anal uh, community, something American anal community. Um, I, I think that's, um, what, what, what do you call that, Justin? That's. I call that, I call that uh, not very nice. No, man, that's what I call that. I call that Final disrespect. Mm, no Final says the VA is going to to be protesting this group. That's insane. <laughs> is that? I mean, we're we're just a club. No man. But who whisperer asks, is this a communist channel, Justin? No. <laughs> Why are we banning heroes? Okay, he's got to behave himself in the AC and not act like a total troll. Okay. Lollipop Guild asks, would Bo Krause be eligible for this group? I mean, the guy is a top-tier archer. <laughs> not really. I've, Max Hatchel Archery is so much better. Um, uh, There's forgiveness with Bo. I forgive him now. Um, But I doubt he would ever want to join the AC. No, man? Yeah. Okay, thank you, Grizz. Thank you. Um, will Bergs be used for target practice? Says uh, Bob Karen. <laughs> oh, I would love to. Well, he's all volunteered once. <laughs> yeah. Grizz270 says, you're calling Moose riffraff? Well, no, it, it, it's not that. It's just that people... Sometimes people want to cause trouble. And I think, I think uh, Moose and the chairman have rubbed Justin the wrong way. And again, he is the president, and he has the final say. Yeah. But a whisper asks: Are women allowed during their cycle to be part of the AAC? What? Moose uh, says military veterans have dark humor. Get over it. Okay, I get it. Okay. But a whisperer says it was a typo, Justin. He didn't mean anal like that. Really? Mm. Planet Moose says we call that being a snowflake and is a beta move by possibly blocking. Well, I'll put it this way: you want an AAC, okay? But we don't. We don't do. We don't do. Oh, I'm okay. Christian. Okay, you have to understand, yeah. right? I'm Christian. Okay, so uh, how about how about this? How about this? Let's baptize Moose in the AAC, along with Mind Blown Watcher, along with Grizz Two Seventy, yeah. and all these people in here right now. Let's go down the list. Yeah. Okay. Grizz says, "I don't join groups that ban war heroes." I'm not trying to ban him, and I was I lifted the ban. No man. Mind blown. Watcher says Moose just just having flashbacks to barracks life. It's a I club. Will... It's not barracks life. I mean, it's like what the. No man. Moose says I will be starting an, an actual apex community. Okay, 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 okay. Relax, 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 relax. I'm starting <laughs> a new club called the AAC. Uh, no, there's only one club. Yeah, exactly. And stay away from TAC fam. Nope, 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 you're not, you are not, you guys have been baptized under the AAC, so now you got, now you probably got like 70 people in your, in your, in your clan. Awesome. Yep. See, exactly. <laughs> I'm just excited about the whole concept and I am willing to follow it blindly. 
says uh, lollipop. Do we do we want people who are blindly following your your you know your dog? No, because that's not what it's about. Here's the thing. Um, I'm pretty much uh, as a leader. I'm pretty peaceful. Um, as a leader, I make decisions, but you know it's more like you know in a way that's kind of like a a light touch kind of leadership. You know. Um, I listen to people, I hear their input, you know what I mean? Um, then I make decisions depending on what that is, you know what I mean? Nevni wants to know, will there be Jews in the, uh, organization? Can Jewish sure. people be? Sure. Absolutely. Yeah. Can Wishbone be the official mascot for the AAC? Well, again, I'm going to show you guys what we got going on here. This is what Justin, uh, wants. Uh, this this is the the logo for the AAC, and that's a guy shooting a BB gun. It's not a BB gun. It's a it's a PCP air rifle, actually. And then a woman shooting a um, bow and arrow. arrow. Yeah. Well, this is this is this looks like a lot of fun. I think that we should do we should have a full baptism here. I think you should probably give a speech. And ordain these people as AAC members. They are officially members of the AAC. Um, so, all right, we're gonna we're gonna go down the list. We're gonna see who's who's fully involved. Okay, Planet Moose is he in the AAC? He is, but you have to understand, there's a lot of Christianity involved in the AAC. So the uh, kind of you know dirty language, <laughs> uh, keep it down to a minimum. You know I mean? Okay, butthole whisper. Is he in the AAC? Uh, does he have a background in shooting, or does he want to learn to shoot? Brian PC AAC. Yeah, maybe. Does he want to learn how to shoot? You know I mean? They don't even that. Mind blow watcher AAC. Pets can't shoot. Um, yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Lollipop Gildor AAC. Of course. All right. Grizz No Teeth two seventy AAC. Yeah, he's a backdoor outdoor guy, and, and he he shoots guns. I think he can shoot air guns if he wanted to. Are people, Lollipop Guild, uh, who's also already a member of the AAC, wants to know, are people with Red Rider guns considered true OG? Because they were kind of like the first BB guns that people had. Air, air rifles, I'm sorry. No, they're just considered a part of the shooting group. You can bring what you want um, uh, to shoot. Buff Carrot says you're only allowed five swear words a year in the AAC. Yeah, like, there, there, are there any rules? I mean, what are the rules in the well, AAC? I would just say don't get vulgar. Don't get, like, nasty. There has to be certain rules and codes of conduct in the AAC. Um, acting, you know, like um, vulgar, you know, it's just not good. I mean, it doesn't look good upon the club. You know what I mean? You know? And how vulgar, I mean, wh who, who's the defined vulgar? Acting overly vulgar, like, you know, like, you know, like anal stuff. That, that stuff doesn't. Uh... All right. So, Moose, you, you, you can't be, you can't be doing the whole anal stuff. And <sighs> we want to have a good image, like a wholesome, family friendly image. No, man. <laughs> Chris brings up a good point. Chris says, I don't need to join. I already know how to shoot. Um, you know, I, again, this is all about teaching and learning, Grizz. Like someone yeah, had to I mean, it's like, it yeah. you know, you know, you know how to shoot. Okay, I get that. But it's about shooting together as, a, as having fun as well. And it's also about learning about different types of, you know, weaponry and stuff like that. Now, I, I've had a lot of members who met together. I've had an archer who didn't know anything about PCP air rifles, that mass tactical archery. He was fascinated by the launchers and the, I uh, told about the PCPs and, and stuff like that. And um, he, so we learned from each other. We learned yeah, the different kind of like, tools. Kind of like if someone taught Grizz how to brush his teeth years ago, he would have been, he would have a good teeth. <laughs> you know, he would have, 
Yeah. <laughs> Grizz is in my is in my AAC club. Well, you know what, Moose? Maybe you should go join TAC Fam. Maybe maybe TAC Fam is a better uh, organization for you than the AAC. Maybe TAC. Yeah. But of course, uh, you will have to take orders from. Uh... All right, we're gonna we're gonna bring up a guest real quick. Okay, someone wants to come up and talk to you. Okay, I go ahead. Completely reject your invitation. As I was discarded, I am an actual military veteran with actual combat experience. I am sorry that your beta views were so offended by my ill-attempted humor to you, beta club. Oh, okay, so okay, 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 okay. We are able to, no, 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 don't stop me. I want to talk. Uh, uh, as a true beta, we have the ability to distinguish between humor and homophobic slur. And someone who can't accept that, I don't want to be a part of that club. I am officially starting my own Apex community, the real A. <laughs> Good and luck. Real AAC. And I've already got more members. We all want to be part of this. We're going to have right. fun. We're going to shoot right. actual this is guns, not BB guns, not slingshots, actual weapons that can do harm. Because in a real confrontation, if someone comes at me with a BB gun, you know what's going to ha happen? I'm going to get a, a Band-Aid. That's all that's going to Here's happen. the thing. We're not talking about BB guns. We're talking about PCP, which is oh, firearm yeah. power. Oh, yeah, because you know what that could do? That could leave a welt as opposed to a Band-Aid. No, you know, that could actually kill you. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know what? I guarantee you every single one of my guns would kill you. <laughs> Not could kill you, would. No, they would, actually. PCP is about that powerful. Oh, uh, what is Dave, it tell me about the power of PCP. Yeah, are you talking about the drug that you and your uncle used to take when you made love in his van? or No, PCP, precharged and Matic. Yeah? And what is the projectile made out of? It's uh, basically either a pellet or a large slug. <laughs> or a vibrating dildo, correct? Oh, boy. All right, so this, this is exactly what we didn't want in the uh, he, AAC. He, he is weak compared to the real AAC. Can the real AAC community please give me a one in the chat? Thank you. I'm out. Bye. You're not the real AAC. All right, he's not. He's he's banned for life, correct? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, Moose, you are banned for life. I also want to. I also want to say publicly that Butthole Whisperer is going to be banned for life, and I also think that you should ban Grizz Two Seventy for life because of that, because of Moose's actions. What did What did Grizz do? He just keeps saying that he's like he's like oh he goes okay if I join uh will you put an apple on your head and trust me? <laughs> oh boy, so stupid. These are people that want to have fellowship and shooting. You know, I got a lot of members already. I mean, you don't you want to mock the club I'm, that I'm a part of? I mean, that I'm the president of, president of, you know. Now, Butthole Whisperer is starting up again by saying Planet Moose has all the testosterone. I don't, I think that's ridiculous. Uh, Brian PC is breaking in with a, well, that, that is nice. A gun off, chat off about weapons. This sounds quite manly. Thank you, Brian PC. Lollipop Guild breaking in with some uh, comments saying, this is why we need to stock the armory. I, you know, I didn't want Justin. This is where I didn't want it to go. Yeah. Everybody's going crazy. Yeah, I mean, you got a lot of trolls in your channel, but you know, I just the difference between me, I don't want them to speak most of the time. But um, mm -hmm. trolls don't really want to speak on my channel. Guys, yeah. guys, this is a this is an organization. Have fun. It's brotherhood. It's friendship. It's, you know, all these things. It's not for fighting. We're not we're not trying to start a, a militia or military organization. It's a bunch of dudes just getting together in the woods with weapons and having fun. Right? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. And, of course, women. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, and women, too. Yeah, and they want to, you want to talk about the air rifles, right, not being that lethal. Tell me about the PCP and what they can do. You've seen what these... Oh, butthole whisperer, you weren't being attacked. You came in here with your vicious uh, rhetoric, and you try to you try to turn everything around on Justin. 
Planet Moose breaks in with saying, what do you know about Brotherhood? A lot. A whole whisper saying it sounds liberal. Uh, Planet Moose breaks in with saying, dudes getting together in the woods with lots of lotions. That's not true. Uh, uh, I, you know what they call that? They call that uh, dieseling. Uh, when you put when you put like uh, like um, petroleum jelly on the ends of yeah, I don't want to think about it anyway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Buff carrot says write down a list of what's allowed in the AAC and what is not. Very good, very good uh, um, recommendation. Well, I'll put it this way: the AAC, you can have fun, you can tell a few jokes, but you can't be disrespecting people. You just can't be di disrespecting others. You know. You can't be just being uh, being disrespectful and rude to people. You want no man. All right. So yeah, now now we got a problem. Now we got a problem with Tac Fam. We got a problem with the the the, the fake AAC. And yeah. Good luck on. But basically, I don't know what they're gonna come. You can't. I mean. They're the fake AAC, you know, but, um, Lollipop Guild, Lollipop Guild says, are we fly fishing or packing serious air power? I'm for the AAC being a strong alliance. Now, uh, Lollipop Guild has come in here. He wanted to start a fight with TAC fam. He wanted to go after this person, that person. Do we want someone like Lollipop Guild? I'm going to be honest with you. He kind of sounds like he's like, you know. Uh, he might be useful. <laughs> okay. uh, Planet Moose says, I'm serious about starting it. I I am trademarking it now. Not really. It's my baby. AC is my baby. You know what I mean? Uh, Real Life says, Tech Fan Militia sounds like more fun. It's mm -hmm. not once you get in. Trust me. Oh, look at look at Butthole Whisper trying to get your trying to get your members. Lollipop Kill, join us. No way in hell, Butthole Whisper. No way in hell. I'm real AAC for life. For life. Exactly. Real AAC. At uh, least Planet Moose said I'm going to file a lawsuit against Justin name. for infringement. For infringement. Yeah. <laughs> they do this all the time. <laughs> it's funny a little bit. Brian PC says, if I had a weapon right now, I may be arrested. However, we have a low tolerance in my country. Not that I need weapons to be respectful. I respect the weapons. Disrespecting the weapons is a danger. That's the type of guy that we want in the AAC. Exactly. Yeah, we don't want no butt talking, uh, uh, back rubbing, um, uh, baloney talk in the AAC. Yeah. Well, you can go do that at Tac Fam, uh, Butthole Whisper. Go join Tac Fam. You are not the real AAC. Uh, real life, welcome to the real AAC. No. No. I'm the original AAC. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, they want to steal my name. They're trying to steal your name, and they're also trying to steal your members. Wow. Yeah. What a fake organization. Five Planet five. Moose is trying to lure these men in with all members will be all members of the real AAC is assigned a woman. Wow. Wow. Oh boy. You know what I think should happen, Justin? I think you should go live right now and maybe uh, explain what's going on, how you're the real AAC and nobody else can can be better than you, etc. I think it's just a troll, Dave. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but it's funny. I gotta admit. Yeah. I think everyone I gets it. it. I think everyone's playing around, Justin. Yeah. Trans people allowed in either of the AACs? <laughs> yeah, what about that? Are, are homosexuals and trans people allowed in the AAC? Don't. I would say don't make it, don't be a flamer and come in the AAC because this is about, you know. Well, what does that mean? Does that mean like people like, listen, like don't bring your, don't bring your sexuality to the AAC. The AAC has yeah, nothing to do with it. Don't bring it there. Don't bring it there. Yeah. 
Yeah. Well, what if what if what if one of the guys wants to bring his boyfriend to uh, an AAC meeting and they're holding hands, like kind of like a uh, maybe I would bring seasons to an AAC meeting. Is that allowed? Uh, I want the AAC be a family kind of affair, a family event. Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, what if what if Moose walks in with his boyfriend and his little uh, child? Like I'm saying, I'm a Christian. I have Christian values. I uh, I would try to basically say, you know, I'm not going to kick him out or nothing, but you can't make that pub stuff publicly. You know what I mean? Now, real life is saying, don't ask, don't tell. It's a good policy. Yeah, don't ask, don't tell. Uh, Mind blown watcher is saying, "Wait, which group provides the hookers? That would be the fake AAC, not the real one." Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, Planet Moose is still going strong by saying, "In the real AAC, we like our beer cold." Our TV loud and our homosexuals flaming. What do you think about that? I mean, how are you going to compete with that, dude? There's a lot of gay Stop people shooting. out there that want to shoot PCPs and slingshots and bows and arrows. I mean, you're excluding them from uh, having fun outdoors and indoors. What are you talking about? They want to shoot, yeah. Well, I'll put it this way: we, there will be times when we'll have a beer, maybe as, as men. You know what I mean? Uh, we'll um. There are times when we'll uh, just have a barbecue or something. You know what I mean? All right. So Moose is back in the AAC. He's back in the AAC. Oh, I. I mean, he's a military veteran, but he's not really into air guns, and he doesn't really know how powerful PCP air rifles are. No, I mean, but these are not you know, BB guns, man. No, man. Right, but but Justin, we're 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 here to have fun, right? The AAC is about fun. The AAC is about fun. It's about fun and learning how to shoot. You know, yeah. it's, it's it's a family. We're trying to be a family, and we want a family friendly I- image, pretty much. You know, kind of like a wholesome family friendly image. You know, I okay. mean, okay. So, what do you, what do you, what do you picture like uh, an AAC event uh, being? Oh, different kinds of shooting competitions. You know, mm-hmm. uh, like air gun competitions, um, slingshot competitions, archery crop uh, competitions, crossbow competitions. You know, even slinging competition. Who knows? Shepherd nuts, and, nuts and crackers are saying, I'm always amazed by the amount of interest that is shown to the huge number of complete buffoons. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Nuts and Crackers. That's true. I have to agree with that. He's not a grand wizard, um, mind blown watcher. Family friendly, unless your family is gay. Come on, let's not. Let's not go down that dark and dirty, dirty road. The fact the fake AAC would hire Dylan Mulvaney to promote the membership. Yeah, you're right about that. You're right about that. Yeah, you're kind, of, you're kind of more of like a Kyle right now. Down after that, you won't get any members after you hire him. After hire that thing. <laughs> yeah. Nuts and crackers, welcome to my AC. Oh, come on. I have some sharp hookers in my tackle box already, says Brian PC. The AAC sounds great, folks. Yep. But a whisper saying fake guns versus real guns. Buff Carrot says, I heard the AAC is prejudiced toward towards midgets. Is that true? I like midgets. They're okay. Mm. Yeah. One of my favorite comedians is uh, Brad Williams. Funniest love, guy. Yeah, we Funny love guy. Brad Williams. Yeah. You're not going to put any yucky in my mouth, are you? What I've the? never... 
Yeah, I don't know what the hell. I don't know what is up with nuts and crackers. I've never encountered anyone so damn intent on making BB guns out to be more than glorified toys. Just because they can be dangerous doesn't prevent them from being toy guns. We're not talking BB guns here. I'm trying to tell you. Can you explain, Dave, what right. we're talking about? Guys, there's these pre-pneumatic uh, air guns. I I've seen them. They take down buffalo. They take down gorillas, uh, zebras, and giraffes. Mm. And also crack coconuts right in half. Right in half. Yeah. So they're, they're, they're not less than lethal. They're just less lethal. Well, now, now there's a difference, Dave. Pre-charged pneumatic is lethal. Oh. Less lethal is a CO2 power. No, no. There you go. Um, too bad. Welcome to my AC. Oh, my God. Justin offers Bud Light to his members. That's not true. Thanks, Planet Moose. Uh, we call them little people in my AAC, and they are welcome. Well, they're also welcome here. Uh, so we can have Dwarf. No, we're not doing that to people. Those are human beings. Too bad. Uh, it's part of our club. No, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can we, can, we make, can we make these girls the, the members of cheerleaders for the AAC? Like kind of like how uh, the, well, I had the idea before of having a cheerleader for my channel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, why don't we talk about that? I thought we I thought we were gonna do that. It never happened. Well, I didn't want to do it this uh, time. I wanted to do it around this time, around the summertime. I mean, uh, I wanted. I would still want to do it, but it's just got to be around the summertime. I mean, you want to do something like that? Have like a cheer, like a sexy cheerleader kind of type. Um. You know, you know, like in the summertime when you're out there in the woods and stuff. Um, <laughs> Chris. <laughs> oh, Krista. All right. Well, all right. So, Justin, w w you have any last words? I think you should go live after this. I may promote uh, it. I would say that the AEC is a very fun club if you want to learn how to shoot and have fun with other people, you know, with uh, with like minded people. And um, like I say, the AEC is not just, you know, it's um, we're we're just basically a, a, a sportsman's club, you know, it's it's sportsmanship, fellowship, fun. Yeah. You know? Okay. All right. So that's your last words. Yeah. All right. You want to go live after this? Tell everyone to come over to your show. Sure. All right. So you know, again, guys, we're just having fun. Everyone was having fun here. Everybody was having a good time, right, Justin? You had a good time joking around, yeah. promoting the AC and all that stuff. Yeah. All right, guys, and 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 seriously, if you want to get in touch with Justin, you know, put a put a comment in his uh, in one of his videos and say you want to join. You know, Justin's taking names, and you know, hopefully we can get this off the ground, Justin. You know. Yeah. You're right. I'm fine. He's a little tired. That's all. Come in. All right, you gonna go live or no? Yeah, I'm gonna go live. All right. All right, guys. The AAC is the best. Uh, Justin, you had a lot of views here tonight, uh, based thank on you. the AAC. So, guys, thank you very much. Um, let's give out a sh let's give out a final shout out to the AAC members. That's Brian PC, AAC member, Butthole Whisper, AAC member, Planet Moose, AAC member, Buff <laughs> Carrot, AAC member, Brian PC, AAC. yeah, Grizz Two Seven, AAC. Mind Blown Watcher AAC, Real Life AAC, and <laughs> Nuts and Crackers AAC. I think that's about it. Exactly. Oh, what about what about this guy? Too bad stupidity isn't painful. AAC or not? I think he was referring to the trolls. All right. AAC, painful. Congratulations. Wait, he's saying toy guns. Yeah, he's he's this guy's not in. Mm -hmm. Tony Smith, welcome to the AAC. 
Justin, yep. I think you have, I think you have like um like at least ten new members. So now you're up to like seventy seventy members in the AAC. That's awesome. Yeah. Good job, man. Good job. We're doing good. Yeah. All right. Love you guys. Take care. Justin, I'll see you over your channel, all right? Yeah. All right. Bye.